Greetings and salutations, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of SMT5 Demonless. Last time, we got our asses kicked by Snake Mommy. Yeah. So now we have to deal with that. Uh, I think what you said last time is definitely the strat. Like, we definitely want to come in that with force resistance. Uh, at least force resistance. We do have force resistance. And uh, it kicked our ass. I'm sorry. Force world. immunity. Because force resistance obviously isn't enough. Exactly. We might even want to might even want to go as have, We do have force immunity right there. And she only that's fine. What does Sudama have? Nothing we really need. Not right now anyway. Yeah. Do we have Nothing someone... that we can probably get later. Do we have someone else that could give those to us? And, like, can we get Force Immune without blowing Sudama? Doesn't look like it. So that definitely seems like the, that definitely seems like the way we want to go. Mm -hmm. At least for this one. Yeah. How is this? Nyom. Nyom. So that so that basically solved the entire problem with her. In terms of at least in terms of the big damage. When you yeah. Like she can still whittle us down with like basic moves, I guess. But and like Mazio, that's not, yeah. Like Mazio isn't even that much stronger than her reg regular fizz. Exactly, which is why I'm not too concerned about it. Like the main thing plus, I'm obviously plus it's Maz Mazio, which like. AOE damage is it kind of works off of S and as of, from Nocturne's uh, the way Nocturne does it, where it's weaker than the base version. Yeah, I think most of the games do it like that. To be fair, SMT four doesn't. Does it not? I thought it did. It does not. Really? That's why it the AOE version are just superior because they do pretty much the same amount of damage as the regular version. Huh. As someone who did the the demonless version, I can yeah. AOE version of the skill is just superior. Yeah, I think you were the only one who was crazy enough to be able to vibe with Emmanuel on that one. <laughs> Yeah, that, 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 I'm, I don't want to do that. That, that, that one can eat my ass. I mean, granted, he, he only did the bosses demon list, didn't he? Uh, yeah, he did, but, like, that's the, that's the important part, to be fair. Yeah. Like, once you get the bosses down, you basically got the rest of the thing now, it's just, like, you know, commit to the bit. Can we not get that glory up there? Uh. I'm gonna make sure. Pretty sure we did. But yeah, no, like the bosses are easily the most important part, so like I'm not faulting him for this like, you know, shortcutting a little bit there. I mean I'm not either, I'm just saying. Like he he probably didn't have a hard time setting up like I did. Yeah. The setup is easily the hard part. Like dedicating the entire run to Demon List is definitely harder. But like Commit to the bit. It doesn't it's it doesn't matter as much as getting all the bosses. Mm-hmm. Because the bosses are bastards. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey! Like I remember pumping iron at the gym while you were talking to me about some of the bosses in that. I remember you had a treadmill and you were just like, oh my god, I finally beat Matador. Not Matador, uh Minotaur. Oh yeah, Minotaur Demolus is a <laughs> Yeah, I was, I was on the treadmill when you did that. I'm just like, I finally grinded Jonathan up to the point where it was even remotely feasible. Yeah, you basically had to grind until Jonathan learned Bufula. Yeah, because it was based on your level in that game, if I recall. I think so. But yeah, and it's just like, until Jonathan is able to actually, you know, be effective on his own merit... The game just doesn't exist for Minotaur. Mm-hmm. Which is comedy. No. 
Young man, I detect YMCA in there. <laughs> Young man, I detect Jehovah's Witnesses behind your door. Oh, oh shit, no. they're here. Oh shit, they're hot. Oh no. My name is Nua. Prepare to die. He killed my father. Prepare to die. Look, that's the only thing that line is missing. <laughs> I could have not saying that. Uh, what are you gonna say? Look Nothing! It's time! <laughs> Look at her hair, Robin. I know. I, <laughs> I, I, in all ser, in, in all, in all seriousness, I like the way she is modeled. Seeing a lot of like the really weird-looking SMT models models out like this is actually really nice to see. Yeah. So Mazio is a little scary, but it's not like crazy scary. You know what I mean? Yeah, you can at least uh, be a. Yeah. How does that do now, by the way? He sent him out. Okay. Plus, it's basically a full heal. Yeah. Fire. Fire. I'm so used to zero, I'm sorry. Now she's showing you her zero. <laughs> Look, it, it wouldn't be an. It wouldn't oh, be a rock. No, I, I, no, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> Why are you using medicine? Safety and conservation of MP. Mm -hmm. Well, you can use a life stone on that one. Yeah. He was barely taking any damage from that. Yeah, we don't. It feels like we wanted a really sledgehammer. We need to be a little bit higher level, but I don't really want to sledgehammer every boss. Yeah. It's supposed to be alternates between Maz uh, Zan phase and electric and physical phase. I'm noticing. Probably. That means we could probably uh... predict around it. Yeah. Yeah. We don't we have uh, electric dampeners? Mm-hmm. So assuming under that He's about to use Zanma. Yeah. No. Nope. There's physical. So it would seem to be random then. Alright. So she's weak to fire. Do we have fire gems? Yes. Mm. We wanna soften her up. And, yeah, let's do a little bit at a time for right now. Let's we'll soften her up. We don't know if she has a phase two, so. Well, we saw her skills, so. Yeah. Ah, ball sack. Double ball sack. You have Diaz. She has a lot more health than I would like. Mm-hmm. Let us test you. Zanma. <laughs> Alright, thank you. Alright, we can link her again. She is still weakened, but she's about to uh, lose one. Exactly. That's why I Rakunda. So I want to because know whether she's because re because remember it only lasts two turns for us because yeah we don't get the uh, the rest of our turn because we don't have demons on our side. Yep. So that Fire. does corrections. <laughs> Interesting. This is Good. Thank you. That'll let us get one more, doesn't it? Uh, it only it, it caps at two, I believe. Oh, that's lame. All right, let's 
capitalize, I guess. I'll go all out just this once. Good as good a time as any. Take this. Two hundred. How the fuck how much HP does she have? A lot. Can you please pound sand this? That he's got a lot of a lot of HP. Yeah, this is this is actually a boss. Let us test you. Good. She's she's the mad she's the Minotaur. He's not using he's not really kicking our ass as hard as a Minotaur. I need more mana. Mana. Alright, Zanma. Alright, Zanma. Yeah, as long as she uses Zanma, it's basically free for us. Okay. Alright! Remember when I said I'd go all out to this once? Watch this. I lied! <laughs> I'm doing it again. If at first you don't succeed, do it again. Oh yeah. It seems to be the strat. Look at the darkness on her feet. She doesn't wash her feet. That's nasty. Uh, uh, nasty. Mm. I don't want to know what she does at high. Pi I don't want. She's gonna go all out just this once. I don't want to know what she does. Well, she's gonna do crits. Because we know what her Magatsui is. Okay. Like, what if she uses Zanma to try and create? You know what? I saw a comment on YouTube recently. Uh huh. It said that basically whenever anyone does their Amagat Amagatoki critical, they always have a specific move they go into. Uh huh. She's not used that big debuff damage move yet. That's probably what she's going to use. And like, they probably use their unique move if they have it, because it tends to be the strongest one they have. And we're immune to it. Yeah. Which means this is a safe turn. Okay. And we're about to lose our debuff if we don't be up it right now. Alright, let's do it. This is it on the super side, or it's a good play? Let's find out. Uh, it's a good play! play. Now, kill. No. It's a little. Oh. <laughs> That's force damage? That looks like fire damage to me. Should have been okay, fight. go off. 88. Nice. Yeah! Yeah! Yes! Yes! Come to Papa! Yes! Alright, All right. we're about to lose our debuff, but we are also about to hit Magatsumi Critical. So. Uh huh. Oh, please keep throwing this. Please, ma'am. You ready? Art thou ready? Art thou ready? Take this. Oh! The fact Damn. that that didn't do any noticeable damage is concerning! Like it's it's a slow process, but we're getting there. Oh, All right, so we that's... know she's throwing at the stage. Yeah. She's about to lose that debuff. Ow. 
It's a process to keep this one up. Yeah. I use fire shards while we're waiting. Yeah. But I will try to uh, re up on chakra drops in the meantime. That way we might be able to actually keep throwing out the big shit. Because I'm aware at this point this game works on SMT Strange Journey rules, where uh, the stones have their own specified magic stats. Yeah. Which I kind of like, in all honesty. It me it makes it so that like using that those uh using the stones are not necessarily the best strategy. But it also means that you can't mi that it'll make uh can you beat SMT five with only with only consumables a uh, much harder run. Yeah. <laughs> Good luck, Gnarly, if you're ever gonna do something like that. God help <laughs> you. <laughs> Oh, I must go all out. Just this once. Just this once. Can someone are... can someone DM Casey to uh just have them go like, I must go all out just this once, and just mod that into the game so they can have that every time they say that. Yes. Like get them to say that. That'd be fucking based. Fire gem. We only have one more, huh? Damn. Oh, we're done? I gotta take oh. her. Okay. I gotta take her. Uh, okay. Yeah, I, I mean, if, if she's done, she's done. Oh, it's Rhino! Oh. I thought Hi, Rhino. cleaning up the stragglers, but he looks like no angel I've seen. Yakumo. Look at his pretty eyes. Okay. My name is Shohei Yakumo. Exterminator of demons. Wearer of eyeliner. I am totally not Raito, Kuzunoha. Take solace in our meeting, boy. I'll make your death a painless one. Oh, you no, complicate I... things. Come now, Yakumo. Surely you can stay your hand for a moment more. Another of your whims. Well, he stood up to me so valiantly, without a flicker of fear. Sin. Bad luck, boy. It seems fate has something more painful in mind for you. <laughs> they seem to be willing to talk. What will you ask them? What's with all the dead angels? Is that what you want to ask? I don't know. I'm all, I'm, I'll leave this one up to you, because uh, uh, both are equally valid questions to me. Sure, what happened to all the angels? Isn't it obvious or why, enough? Why dead? Bethel is our enemy. Okay, okay. Oh, okay. I am the Ooh, goddess fast. Nua, creator of the mortals and inhabitant of the ethereal chasm between heaven and earth. Oh, you're a big dick in the world. The man beside me is Yakumo. I suppose one could say he is my other half. Oh! God damn, Yakimo, good job! <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, Yakimo fucking above his pay grade! Oh no. The god of law has warred with the other gods since time immemorial. However, the god of law gained the upper hand when he robbed the other gods of their knowledge. Debasing them to their current states. Yeah, that's oh, they're no longer base. Cronies in Bethel have absolute they are now cringe. The law, and his armies continue to meddle in this realm to protect his order. Such zealotry cannot be permitted. Ergo, these angels were dealt with accordingly. Which is not to say those who rebel against the god of law are any better, of course. Opportunistic cretins, for the most part. Seeking chaos to fulfill their own selfish desires. An oddly pragmatic view on chaos, Nua. Chaos, chaos. <laughs> like, she's not just like... People just fucking sowing chaos for their own designs. It's just like... They're no better than the people so like... Sucking God's dick. 
Wow. Like, she's got an oddly pragmatic view of chaos. Like, she's like, I I'm, I'm fighting God, but I've got a plan, man. So is she neutral? She, no, she definitely sounds chaos. She's fighting against God, but like... Mm-hmm. That's why my duty is to slay both the disciples of Bethel and the ancient desecrated beings known as demons. And this point is what finally brings me to my own question. Do you believe God's order is just? That it is necessary for this world? Hmm. Hmm. It was very nocturne, so... Neutral is probably the correct option, but at the same time... I don't know. Uh, I mean, they they clearly don't like God. Yeah, we, we could... we could lie. Order gets in the way. Oh. I knew there was something different about you. Yes, you are quite different indeed from the angels of Bethel. If you See, couldn't... let's let's be friends with them for now. <laughs> I look forward to seeing what you can accomplish. Do you have any styling tips about your hair? I've been looking for a way to contain this for like the last fucking week. <laughs> How do you get your hair like that, N Nua? I, I, I need a, a I need something for my hair. Device. The same design as the one Bethel's trying to use. use it Do you to have a hair tie or something? You know so well. Wait, you whoa! See the truth. Oh. See gods and demons alike fighting over humanity, and Tokyo caught in the crossfire. <laughs> Until we meet again. IRL Tokyo and the actual world at the same time? Huh. That's peculiar. And save immediately afterwards. Something's about to happen. I don't think SMG's ever done that before, just like directly made a separation between the two. I don't know. Never played the first two, so I wouldn't know. <laughs> I mean, fair. Uh, this gives me some fucking. Man, I know they're just basing it off of the actual IRL uh, diet building, which they have active reference for. But man, see, just like walking through the diet building just gives me hard SMG3 vibes, and that fucking triggers my PTSD. Yeah. Look, I well, know this I'm... gives this gives me hard Persona 5 vibes. Look, I know I'm being a Persona <laughs> fan right now, but I'm not Japanese. I don't have any reference point for the Japanese. I can, I. All I know is Nocturne. You can't fault me for that. You know Persona 5, which also has a diet building in Shido's Palace. Uh, ah! Where you also fight some male. Uh, haha, funny SMT3 reference in Persona 5. Oh, hey, it's him. It's Ryuji. Ah, not another one. It's okay, fam. Yeah, you got a hat, hat that says sucker. Why would you wear that? Yeah. Wait, wait a second. I know that face. Sir. Is that you? Richard. At least wear a hat that says it's get me, smoked. Ichiro Dazai. Ichiro Dazai. Boy, am I glad to see you're all right, man. How'd you but, live? Uh, he got kidnapped by the angel early on, remember? Though. All right. How do you survive Whoa. this onslaught? It's gotta f Wait, put so him in the back. Wait, you this is all because you fused with that Aogami guy? We actually just told him everything? I see. Oh, okay. Strange turn of events. How the fuck did you get here? What? <laughs> Good to see you and Dazai are fine as well. How the huh? flim flam did you get here? Yuzuru I mean, he does have demons. I was in the tunnel. Valid. Same as you. It's a relief to know we all made it out of This guy over here playing Devil Survivor. Now that we're reunited, <laughs> I'll leave it to you to decide our next move. Y yeah, lead the way. Lead the way, Lancer. Hey! 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 Oh, fuck up. Oh, 
well, well, that was a big surprise, right? <laughs> right? That demon was freaky strong. Can't believe it scared me off like that. <laughs> <laughs> Howard. Hey, Pixie would never have like ran. Who you were looking for? Well, good for you. Oh, I guess from here on out, you're gonna go with those humans, huh? <laughs> totally. Uh, nothing. Never mind. I'm not lonely or anything. I've been on my own this whole time, you know. Oh. Anyways, thanks for bringing me along all this way. I'm gonna hang around here for a bit longer, so just let me know if you want me to come with you. All right? I'll be literally right back. Well, I'm out of here. Bye bye. See you later. Oh, get eaten. Mazak. What? <laughs> what? Did you just say get eaten? Yes. What the fuck? She is, Why? She has done nothing wrong. She's, she existed. She has done whole ass nothing wrong. She's done everything wrong, such as existing. Amanazako is based. No. I, I will, disagree. I will not sit here and By the way, tolerate. I know you decide. I know I asked you to decide our next move, but what do you suggest we do now? We mentioned what Yakima said. Mm. So there's a transportation device up ahead that'll take us back to the old Tokyo, right? <laughs> hey, yo, that's what I'm talking about. All right, let's hurry up and get back home. <laughs> All right, let's hurry up and get back home. Uh, f fuck off. Well, let's go back home, I guess. Oh, <laughs> hey, it's a terminal. Mm -mm -mm -mm. This is hey. Ogami from the Bethel Japanese branch. Do you copy? What? Ogami? This is the unit from way back when? What? I have successfully reactivated, returning to base. What? I don't believe it. No. I'm gonna have to report this, but you're clear to come through. Touching the terminal should bring you straight here. What? Looks like we'll be able to head back to the Tokyo <laughs> we call home. It's the terminal. Dead ass. The same fuck off model. It's the same model, the same room. I'm gonna see Orlando Bloom. <laughs> Oh, please just give me the same animation. Cringe. Hate. Seethe. Cope. Mauled. Oh, wait, wait. We're still the Nahabino. We've what? Oh. Um. Is this... Are we back in Tokyo? You're not processing yes. the robot? This is Joeyn University's medical research lab. We came in here through the Bethel term. Oh, what? Wanna oh, explain how you know that? That form just now. Explain oh, yourself. Hello. What? We Archangel know her. Angel Abdio. We know her from the one. Right. We know her from his memory. True. Bethel's voice to the set of him. Am I to understand you went against the condemnation? I don't understand your fucking mountain in actual fucking normal Tokyo. Answer, boy. Bethel will have no mercy for one who violates the will of God. What are you talking about, lady? Wait! Master Abdiel! Hmm. Huh? Chiaki! Oh, hey. <laughs> uh, I don't not know what led to this. But he is an innocent bystander. Please forgive him. Shit, did not mean to do that. The saint. Furthermore, the saint. We both know God's laws are not so easily broken. Unbreakable, even. Oh. Then, how would you account for this? Allow the Japanese branch to look into it. Though, what I can tell you is that this is the one they lost all those years ago. What the fuck? 
This was like Nocturne if it had more story. <laughs> Respectfully. Which is Master not a Abdi. bad thing. I heard you were in command at the time. Oh. In which case, I would have imagined you'd be elated by the return of your subordinate. Not angered by it. Oh. Mm. Very well. However, I am placing full responsibility on the Japanese branch to investigate. Okay, I do like the eye movement there. Yeah. Man, like the micro movements scary. of her eyes right What's there. Where she was looking at them all. So that's it's the like, angel in charge of headquarters. Move, move, move. Very well. I was starting to worry about all of you. No, because that's actually how your eyes move whenever Welcome they're back. looking past yeah. by things. Yeah. I think an explanation is in order. Would you mind joining me in the meeting room? Look, if you didn't ask, I was gonna ask you. Also, is no one gonna address the robot? <laughs> I mean, they already know that you fused with the robot. No, Dazai does it. Dazai literally over with, why do you look like that? And then we just literally split into two dudes the second we popped out of the terminal. Well, it seems like in this story, our fellow classmates know more than we do, which is a... Maybe? <laughs> which is a bit different. <laughs> like, the... Uh, Case K, I don't actually know his name, actually seems like we told him everything, so he's less like, okay, yeah, you fused with a random dude, and now you're here, sure. Um, I don't remember if we act actually, we know, we did explain everything to Dazai, didn't we? I think so, like, so when, was we just, when we first met him, he was... Yeah, like, just now. So, just like, everyone was just like, oh, I mean, yeah. We, didn't we see him earlier? By the train? Uh... Yeah, but we went to the Nahobino then. Yes, we were. No, we, we became the Nahobino right after that when he was kidnapped. No. No, not him. The other guy. Uh, Keisuke. Yeah, no. Like, uh, that's Keisuke and Dazai. That's who I'm talking about right now. Like, Keisuke, yeah, we, we already stole... told them. We yeah, already and... told both of them just now. Well, just now and when we saw What's-His-Face at the train. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Like, uh, Keisuke, we told him at the, at the train. And Dazai, we told him just now. It's just know. like that's, that's why I'm explain. That's how like I'm explaining why they aren't really reacting. Yeah, because they already know. Yeah, so it's just like you defuse into two dudes, and he's just like, "Oh right, they were two dudes." Okay, sure. I mean, not even Nahobino questioned it, so yeah. <laughs> Plus, I assume the classmates know more than what we do, especially because of not uh, Yeah. yeah. Which is kind of new. The Bethel Japanese branch is based at Join University. Uh, is based at Join University's medical research lab, where a device known as a terminal can be found. The terminal has the same fun functionality as a ley line fount. As a result, you can use it to save your progress and access ley line crossing. You can idea to keep <laughs> this in course. mind. So the ley lines of Tokyo also act as terminals. Okay. That is giving me very big Nocturne vibes. <laughs> that is the best kind of retcon. <laughs> like, that's just saying, like, oh, yeah, these two things, they're actually the same thing. We've just not told you for 20 years. I mean, they could just be upgraded terminals. I, yeah. Okay, man. Moving, they, moving around the terminal room, though. This design sucks. What do you mean? It's the Nocturne design. Uh, no, there's like, not, not, not the design. Uh, I'm talking about our design. Look at our fucking, look at us. We have no drip. Oh, yeah, we're not doing the Naruto run. You're Neg right. Negative drip. Unbased, blue pilled. Oh no. What is happening here? 
computers. Find the computer room! Now, where do I start? On the beginning. Ow. I guess I should start with me. To put it plainly, I've had spiritual powers ever since I was little. Everyone at Bethel calls me the saint. Uh, mm, fuck. Okay. Sure. Uh, what, what was this, the, the thing? The thing? Uh, this reminds me of something, I can't remember what it is. It's upsetting me. It's not a, it's not a, it's not a Ayane, whatever uh, her name is. Akane? From? Or Orange Chicken Devil Survivor. Amane? Amane, thank you. Picked every fucking consonant except her actual one. Akane? It's not her, but this reminds me of something. Bethel Japan lost a lot of its strength in a battle many years ago. So these days, even students like me are helping out. Fuck. It's the same for me, too. What the fuck? But never mind. Oh, well, so is Tokyo still okay? <laughs> Not long ago, we were in what looked like ruins, and they were crawling with demons. Well, it was almost as if the city had been destroyed. If I told you the Tokyo you'd been living in this whole time was a lie, would you believe me? No. That's bullshit, huh? but I believe it. <laughs> 18 years ago, something happened in the Chiyoda Ward of Tokyo that suddenly erased the city from the rest of Japan. Where okay. is... Nah, Shibuya. Shibuya to, uh... Shinjuku Medical is in Shinjuku, obviously. I'm trying to connect this to Nocturne. Its population oh, of over 10 million people was wiped out in a matter of minutes, lost to the netherworld. What are you talking about, Isonokami? We've been living in Tokyo as far as I can tell. You want to try explaining that? <laughs> the Tokyo you're referring to is an act of God. Through his miracle, Tokyo and its people were perfectly recreated. No one suspected a thing. You mean everything up until now? It's all been fake? As I said, the real Tokyo was destroyed 18 years ago. You saw it when you slipped into the netherworld. This feels like a revelation coming a lot too early. That's impossible. Uh -huh. The real Tokyo has been completely overrun by demons. As if one Tokyo wasn't enough, the demons now covet the other, and all for our souls. Though we are few, that is what the Bethel Japanese branch fights to protect. You look like him. I hope the saint has cleared things up for you. Apologies for dragging you into this. He looks like Aogami. Hey, uh, no, haven't boy. I seen you somewhere before? My name is Koshimizu. I'm in charge here, in addition to being Japan's Prime Minister. Okay. He's probably the one who designed, uh... Aogami. Aogami, probably. probably. Wait, as in Director Koshimizu? One of the top-ranking officials in the Japanese branch? He and the Prime Minister are the same person? How did you not gather that if he's just also named Koshimizu? Are you th stupid? Indeed. <laughs> Glad to see you made it back in one piece, Atsuka. Now that you've been made aware of what happened to the real Tokyo, it's best I enlighten you as to the true state of the world. I actually really like this because it hits a similar note to 4, where you walk into a pre-existing apocalypse. Yeah. Which was like, on, like the moment in, a, uh, in 4 where you walked out to see like this expanding Tokyo before you is one of my favorite seeds in games. Mm -hmm. Just like, Jonathan like, what on earth? It's like a city of, and Walter's like, it's like a city of stars. And Isabel goes, it's beautiful. And you just see the entirety of Tokyo in ruins sprawling before you. Yeah. 
Like that, this is similar to that for me. To put it plainly, the forces of order yeah. and chaos are currently clashing behind the scenes, locked in an ongoing battle unbeknownst to mankind. Demons seek human souls. If given the chance, they would flood the real world in an instant. They are extremely dangerous. Wait, but isn't the world of everyone? That's why Bethel Japan is dedicated to protecting Tokyo and keeping the demons at bay. The demons are relentless, however. And the unfortunate truth of the matter is that we're woefully lacking in manpower. In fact, Bethel's strength is so short of the mark, we've been forced to rely on students such as Isonokami and Atsuta for help. No way! Is that something I could help with too, Mr. Prime Minister? I like Ichiro just like, can I help? You mean protecting mm -hmm. Tokyo? Yeah! I'll do whatever I can! Does I? Look, I'm borderline useless at school, and I'm always making trouble for other people. But even a guy like me wants to be someone people can turn to. Just like the honor students. Thank you. I admire your courage. You go! I've heard about you. So you fused with Algami, is that it? I'll be asking for your cooperation as well. Sorry, but I won't take no for an answer. And what about him, man? He, he was the one that fucking jumped out. Mm-hmm. I never asked for this. How chaos line do we want to be today? I don't know. <laughs> Roll a d10. If you want. Alright, odds... Odds will be law line, evens will be chaos line, zebras are evens. And I just threw the dice off the table. Shiota is located at the very heart of former Tokyo City in eastern mainland Tokyo. The central area of the ward is furthermore occupied by the Imperial Palace. The east side of the ward, bordering Shuo, is the location of Tokyo Station. The south side, bordering Minato, encompasses Habaya Park and the National Diet Building. Hmm. That makes sense. Also, yeah. I rolled an eight, so, uh... I never signed up for this. I understand, but you have no choice in the matter. I'm thankful the Proto-Fiend returned safely, though I've never heard of it fusing with a human before. The Proto-Fiend still fucking sends me. I played a like, that's weird. Uh -huh. creation myself. I'll be running a variety of tests later. I could tell! Algami, I'd like to examine your memory data. They have the same exact fucking to hair, too. They have the same voice actor! Uh-huh. Understood. I'll visit with the rest of you some other time. This is that For one now, spike on both of their models in their hair. Yeah. This is the DM voicing. This is, like, two different characters. Sir! And mm -hmm. lastly, Yuzuru Atsuta. Well done in coming back unharmed. Mmm. Your summoning skills must have improved. I'll be sure to grant you an even stronger demon companion next time. Thank you, sir. He's more in league than even the chick, it seems. Mm-hmm. That's interesting. I need some fucking food, but we don't have a save point yet, so... I should apologize for hiding the fact that I was involved with Bethel. Okay, look, it's not exactly a good conversation starter. I didn't want to get you involved, but... I also didn't think the situation would become as dire as it is now. Understandable. Dude, I get to protect Tokyo! How cool is that? He's just happy to be here. <laughs> I'm gonna be fighting alongside all those big names at school! Me! A big reason I don't do all that well in school is because... Honestly, I'm just not very confident in myself. Even though my parents aren't divorced, they really uh, flex. don't get along. So okay. I guess I've always just been looking for a way to fix things. But if I side with my dad, my mom gets all pissed. And it's the same for my old man if I ever side with my mom. I don't know what's right anymore. Protecting Tokyo from demons, though? That's gotta be a good thing. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. Respect. You know that's fair. <laughs> I, 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 I like Dazai. Like, as uh, like he has something he wants to cling on to. That's fine. Yeah, like I, I, am I'm, I'm here or there on uh, Tao, want to get uh, and uh, Atta, but uh, I, I, like Desai, 
Desire's a real G. Yeah. Like the silent G in lasagna. D Desire's a homie. <laughs> I'm glad we're both alright. Let's work together to keep Tokyo safe. Alright, Case K. I mean, that's. Yeah, Case K. We should probably head back. We've got school tomorrow. We've got school. We've got school tomorrow. With the fucking apocalypse. Sure. Okay. Got by the gable by moonlight. <laughs> we have school tomorrow in this fake ass Tokyo. We gotta Bye. work on our fake ass grade so we can work at a fake ass job. He is the one called Sailor Moon. So are all these people fake too, or no, are they real? They're real, kind of. The way I kind of interpreted it was just like basically God. So Made was, like a, I guess like a pocket universe Tokyo. Kind of. Just like imagine you took like uh, you saved everything on your computer. Right before the moment it got corrupted by uh, an unfixable virus. Got that animation when you're too far away. Yeah. <laughs> but just like, Jitters. yeah, right. But just like the moment before you get your computer gets corrupted by an unfixable virus, you basically save a state of everything that exists on your computer prior to that point, and then you pull that save out. Made it, got a second computer, and booted everything on that one. So then you have two computers. One that's fucked, and one that's basically everything the other computer was before it went to shit. You just described the day of the doctor, Robin. It's a pocket universe, yeah. Yeah! <laughs> Morning. Yesterday was a mess, huh? <laughs> I'm glad you're okay after all that. that that's an understatement. Hmm. Mm, yeah, I, I, I know what you mean. That was a, a lot to do with, huh? All this stuff about demons and gods and weird supernatural conflict, I feel a little overloaded too. But all these gods across the world are working together to keep the peace. Let's, let's keep what happened yesterday a secret, okay? But for now, we get it. Can we? See ya. <laughs> I don't, uh, I don't see how you can go back to being a regular student after learning all that. Uh, she, uh, she's on some hard copium. Also, uh, zero out of ten game, the portrait doesn't change. <laughs> I got this friend of a friend, and he said he saw it look like a tiny human flying through the air. <sighs> yeah, right. Friend of a friend, our sounds very sketchy to me. Bullying, huh? You can't count on school teachers to help. The only choice is to gather proof through voice recording and something to defend yourself. This is like a normal ass conversation, okay. School. This part has some serious persona vibes to it. <laughs> That's cringe. <laughs> okay, I'll stop with the persona shit. My day doesn't start until I have a carton of coffee milk. Is that... that that's... That's not real, is it? Okay, hang up. No. Coffee, coffee milk is a drink made by mixing coffee syrup or coffee extract and milk together in a manner similar to chocolate milk. No the fuck it's not! It is the official state drink in Rhode Island. Fuck Rhode Island! <laughs> I, I, I'm sorry! Oh, okay. While the precise origin of coffee milk is unclear, several sources trace it back to the 19th century Italian immigrant population in Providence, Rhode Island. In the late 19th and 20th century, approximately 55,000 Italian immigrants traveled to Providence. <laughs> okay. Coffee milk. Okay, look. 
Oh look, there's a recipe on how to make it. I need you to understand. My grandpa is Italian. He's easily the best man I've ever met. Uh huh. So I literally cannot say fuck Italy. Because Italy gave me the best man I've ever met. However, I can blame the proxy. Rhode and Island? Anyone of our fans that are from Rhode Island? Fuck you. <laughs> fuck you and your coffee milk. You have sinned? Turn to God. <laughs> <laughs> they went hard chaos <laughs> even Lucifer doesn't want you <laughs> brew oh, one half okay direction uh, step one in a large pitcher her. mix how long do you mix? think until she cracks <laughs> I can't wait to see her break down in tears what the fuck Ooh, she she's cute though Sahori Itsuki Shihima. Itsuki Shim she I can't take this anymore. Itsuki Shihima. Why me? Why is this happening? Girl, you yeah, alright? It's all fair. Maybe she has spiritual powers too. I wish they'd all just disappear. She's gonna fucking She kiss. has she has some sort of devil's mark. Oh, oh I was just... Who's there? Oh, um, me. I'm very good at impressions. <laughs> oh, I guess you didn't like my Lucifer impression. Damn. Oh, hi. Layla. Hey. My brother told me what happened. She he did? Why? Oh. That would turn out that we went back together. Thank you for helping my brother. Wait. Um. I hope you and my brother keep getting along. He's seriously more stubborn than most, and he's known for being pretty inflexible. Everyone thinks he's annoying, so he doesn't have many friends. But he's looked out for me as long as I can remember, especially with me not being very strong and everything. He's a caring person deep down. I uh, really can't do anything about my brother, so I have no choice but to rely on him. Oh, right. You know, talk about Tao reminded me of the strange dream I had when I was little. A prince from another country came specifically for me. It's kind of embarrassing, to be honest. No, oh, but the prince was riding a typical white horse and all that. He sailed a boat through the night sky. Strange, huh? Did he call himself <laughs> Pale Rider by any chance? <laughs> yeah, that's a, a weird dream, girl. Oh, hi, Desai. Oh. All right, who wants to hang out today? Let's get their social links up. <laughs> Everyone's dressed like Squid Game. Morning, man. <laughs> nice being back home again, huh? Uh, I'm joking, by the way. <laughs> Me? I stayed in bed. What? Got this big lecture about I how said, this uh, demon summoning stuff works. I, 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 just, I said everyone's just, just like Squid Game. Oh, yes. This game has some hard Squid Game vibes. That's especially wrong, because that game's that, cause that show's Korean. And the Bethel guys even said I've got this natural talent for it. <laughs> Can you believe that? I'm a demon summoner. By the way, summoner. Robin. Yeah? To make coffee milk in a large pic picture, no! mix, mix milk and coffee syrup until blended. Brew what the one fuck half is coffee syrup. Brew one half cup finely ground coffee with. Oh, okay. To make your own coffee milk syrup, brew one half cup finely ground coffee with two cups cold water in a coffee maker. Combine brewed coffee and one cup sugar in a saucepan simmer until reduced by half about 30 minutes refrigerate up until cold or up to two weeks use as directed it should yield one cup of syrup <laughs> so now you know how to make your own coffee milk syrup so you can make your own coffee milk i'm going to minecraft myself <laughs> i could have gone the rest of my life without even conceiving that that, that just sounds like what 
You can just put milk in coffee! That sounds like... You, you pour a cup of coffee! You, you fill it mostly with coffee! You pour some milk in it! Put some sugar in it! You stir it up! Coffee milk. It just sounds like... It just sounds like coffee with cream with extra steps. Was. But uh, send me that recipe because I genuinely want to know now. Like that literally just sounds like coffee with milk and sugar with extra steps. <laughs> I genuinely want to know what that's about now. There you go. I don't even know if it tastes good, because I've never had coffee milk before. Alright, first you gotta make some coffee cum. <laughs> Refrigerate it for a little bit. And then you can get your coffee milk. <laughs> like, it, like, it better be worth the time it takes to make it. <laughs> if this is not literally the fucking nectar of the gods, I'm not- I, It's not worth it. <laughs> I have no idea why coffee milk has pissed me off this much. It's late. It's 1.30 in the morning when I'm recording this. I'm sorry. It, it's it's the, the brain weasels. That means I can protect people. Like a real hero. So, I'm gonna give this all I got. I love this eye. Anyhow, uh, he's sorry great. to bug you. <laughs> See ya. He's just happy to be around and helping. Yeah, he's pretty cool. He's chill. I vibe with Desai. Oh, yeah. Uh, is this my class? Dude, this is the nurse's office. There's nobody here. There's not even a hot nurse here. That feel with no Takemi. Why live? Wow, this is like... <laughs> okay, I said I would stop. <laughs> <laughs> You made your point. By saying this is like, you made your point. Oh, is this my hey, class? Look, it's classroom. Probably. Gonna study some maths. Maths? What are you, British? Yes. Didn't British. you know? I was born British. British? Who is this tool? All rise. Good morning, sir. Oh, he's a teacher. I I, I figured I was. Just... Six and a half hours later. Holy shit! It actually, was six and a half hours. Okay, of... that's it for today. <laughs> All rise. Thank you, sir. Look at that girl in the back, just like, everyone's just like, respectful bow, she's like, yeet! She just almost face, plant, face plants her, her face on the desk. She definitely gets A's. She is, she's a teacher's pet. Probably. May or may not be, just be in like every single fucking honors program. She's the class president, what are you talking about? Makoto. Oh, hi, oh, bitch. Hey. Richard. <laughs> Look, Richard. can I talk to you about something? Uh, not right now, just when you've got time. Uh, no, sorry, I'm busy for the rest of my life. I don't feel like it. <laughs> I'm not, I don't have the heart to be that mean. True. Thanks. But I can't really talk about it at school. Maybe on the dorm roof later tonight. See you then. Oh, later the, tonight, huh? The dorm All roof. Right. All right. Dorm roof later tonight. Mm. It's like, like the Nahubino has got a sweet date. Like, he didn't even have to do anything. He just became Nahubino, and then he gets bitches. I Good for him. Good for him. I have no dick and I'm laying pipe. 
I, I, I'm sorry. I just, I fucking love the one line of text where you, like, like, you make some sexual statement to a demon, and the, the text is, the demon looks at your non-conspicuous crotch, looks up at you, and starts laughing, and leaves. <laughs> like, the Naopito canonically has so little dick game that it's comical. Oh, hi. Mm -hmm. Oh, hello. I have no dick game. Um, uh, fair. Oh, um, hi there. Thank you for understanding. Hi there, I heard you had no dick game. <laughs> not, I, really, I like not really, not really like, feeling well today. <laughs> I like a man with no dick game. <laughs> Who was that? Oh, it's a Kishima? She was hurt, Oh, that's her name. So I actually I got right. I wanted to help a little. It's a Kishima. The nurse is out for the day, so I just did what I could. Look, um... Do you know how Itsukishima's been getting these injuries? Dead ass. Oh, I asked you who she is. I don't know how to say this, but those bruises couldn't probably all be about abused. Accidents. Either abused or demons. I yeah, wish I could. Abused or demons or abused by I demons. She's okay. Maybe she's newer. I mean, she kind of has that air I about I her. Help. I hope she's okay. Well, like me ask you. But at the same time, everyone else has been their normal selves in the demon world. Yeah. She could be a Nahobina. 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 <laughs> this is gender terminology for Nahobinas. Probably. Why can I still access my party? What am I going to do, summon demons in the middle of a parking lot? Meanwhile, the next cutscene, you summon demons in the parking lot. What the fuck? Hello. <laughs> Yesterday was eventful, wasn't it? Yeah. Just a little bit. Was I, was I, fucking I taught late? Dazai how to summon demons afterwards. He picked it up fast, and Bethel certainly isn't complaining. I just don't know if it was right. He was an ordinary student with an ordinary life, and now... He well, it, seems, in this conflict. it seems like they can He's summon demons in this, in this world, now. too. I chose yes? to fight of my own volition. But does I? It, it, he kind of happened, didn't it? Yeah, but he, like, the second he was given the opportunity, he could have easily just said, Fuck this! Mm -hmm. I just said, Fuck this! Mm hmm. Not just him. I dragged you into this as well. Literally, no. If I'd been more capable, more powerful, maybe I could have handled this on my own. Oh, you are actually just kidding. If I want to be stronger, I'll have to do my part on the front lines. Especially now that we have new power on our side. You're just case but you don't suck. Let's both keep at it. We'll make we sure don't know if he, if he sucks. I mean, we don't know if he misses all of his attacks. And yeah, we gotta fight him first. We gotta figure it out. Yeah. I also love how. Like, based on our character portrait, we now, like, fucking... The Nahobino is who we truly are. Mm-hmm. I identify as a Nahobino. Hell yeah. I mean, Nahobino is just like, I have true power. When I'm the Nahobino, I can use Aramasa. Okay. <laughs> Yo. You know, Sahori Itsukishima. I just passed her, but she looked really down. Something's gotta be getting to her. <laughs> she seems so strong and gorgeous, too. Honestly, I kind of looked up to her. Uh, not that she even knows a guy like me. <sighs> Still, seeing her like this now is killing me. I want to help her, but I'm just some nobody. Mama, like, you, you can summon demons now. Yeah, show her your demons. Maybe just, don't do that, actually. No, no. Like, we don't know if she's in on the whole gig yet. Just, like, go talk to her, man. Show her how your demons are a bit different. Wink, no. wink. No! <laughs> well, hey, world map. Um. Oh, map theme. Hey, look, we still have the phases. Yeah. Join medical lab? Do we need to go somewhere specific? I don't know. 
Well, the headquarters of Bethel seems like a good place to start. Well, we can save at least. Yeah, we can save at least. Where the are you saves. You're crossing into the netherworld. Oh. And I shall accompany you for the time being. Oh, so we can just come here whenever we want. Yeah, alright. So this, 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 this seems to be... It's a little bit of... Okay, you've done it. I'm gonna do it. It seems to be a little bit like a Persona 5. everything where we can cross between the actual fuck zone and the actual planet, which is... I'm, I'm kind of... I dig it, actually. Yeah. It, it, like, it's really... I don't actually think it's happened before, but there's been this clear separation between the actual world and the demon world. So, like, mm -hmm. I kind of, I kind of like it, actually. Yeah. But, yeah, all coffee milk aside, uh, that, uh, we, we will see you guys next time with whatever's happening now, I guess. Because oh, I don't yeah. know whether we need to be in the real world or the demon world or what. Mm-hmm. But we'll, we'll figure it out. Yeah. <laughs> Yep, we'll see you guys next time. See ya.